This morning, an event at the Law Enforcement Firefighters Memorial will honor first responders who died in the September 11th attacks. Wayne 15's Allie McKibben is live at the memorial to preview today's event. Allie. Pat, Sierra, I am here with Mike Patmore, the president of the board of directors of Upstar. Mike, tell me about this remembrance walk that's kicking off today's ceremony. Yeah, so we, it kicks off here today at 10 o'clock. Our group is going to meet over at the Well Street Bridge and uh, kind of do a little walk journey across the bridge over here to the memorial site. And about 10:15, we're going to kick off with the ceremony itself. Um, you know, family members are welcome, uh, friends and family. It's open to the public, so uh, it's also open to our friends and family of our 1,900 members of our trade association, Upstar. Uh, so anybody's welcome to come out to support. Um, all the firefighters and law enforcement officers uh, that are either currently in service or who have, um, you know, passed away in the line of service. So uh, we're here to do um, them justice and honor them uh, today. So we're very excited about that later on today. Now, as a realtor service, why do you find it important to honor the fallen heroes? Sure. Yeah, and, and all the fallen heroes, um, obviously, um, died in service for, for everybody. So, you know, every day, you know, whether you're a firefighter or first responder of any kind, you're putting your life on the line every single day. So, um, you know, that is literally a uh, definition of, of service to the community. And uh, we as realtor members and affiliates of our board find it extremely important for us to give back to the community service and, and provide a community service. And we just want to take a moment, you know, the smallest thing we could do is, is honor them at the memorial site and do just a little remembrance walk and, and do our service today. Now 9-11 nearly happened 23 years ago, kind of a long time, long time, kind of a short time for some people. How do you keep this ceremony relevant for today? Great question. It, I can't believe it's been that long ago. I'm, it's unbelievable to believe. And uh, uh, but no, it's, it's extremely important to keep it keep it current today. Uh, it was something that was so important uh, to, to the U.S. history and to the world history. It, it, it touched the lives of everybody that witnessed those events, whether it was on TV or even in person. Uh, so, you know, keeping that relevant and, and keeping people to understand how important those events were in the aftermath of that is extremely important. So doing a service like this is, is something we want to do for from now until forever, really. Thank you for talking with me again, Mike. Now an article is posted on Wayne.com with the link to register for this event and stay tuned as I'm going to be talking about even more details specifically about the flag planting upcoming live from the memorial. Allie McKibben, Wayne 15 News.